I have told my children that every time they lie, a puppy dies somewhere. <laughs> Use this line on the children. Has it actually stopped them from lying? Well, it certainly seems to have done. Yeah. Because they do care about puppies. Yes. It's <laughs> <laughs> a bit of a relief, actually, that you're saying that didn't result in your children telling loads and loads of lies and getting excited <laughs> by the prospect of puppy death. <laughs> it's heartening on that level. No, I but... don't have sadistic children. <laughs> But it's also bad advice, cos what if a dog goes to attack them and they tell a lie and the dog still gets them? <laughs> Actually... That's it the nearest. <laughs> the nearest, <laughs> nearest dog will die. So you, you just... Know. Well, statistically, you'd hope... Yeah. By osmosis, the yeah. lie will dog, kill... Essentially, you tell the lie, yeah. dog death spreads out from yeah. you till it finds a dog, the dog dies, and then the wave of dog death stops. Can I just ask Joe, why a puppy and not a kitten? She's not sick. <laughs> It was a difficult decision to make. It was a toss-up between a kitten, a puppy and their dad. And <laughs> it's the kind of puppies are the sweetest. What is your verdict? My team say true. You're saying true, yeah? yeah. OK, so, Joe, is it true? It's a lie. Oh. It's a lie. <laughs>